Welcome to Indianapolis for the Scouting Combine, where we just heard from Dennis Allen on Clint Kubiak for the first time since he hired him to be his offensive coordinator. I'm Nick Andreo, and you're watching The Dot, presented by Matt Bowers Auto Group. Allen had some interesting comments about Kubiak today and noted that this is an offensive system that he has liked and been attracted to for a number of years. It's the one that gives him the most trouble every single week. And when he went out to set up his new staff, he coveted it. And here are some of the things he had to say about Kubiak and what he will bring to New Orleans. Just getting an opportunity to visit with him and then doing my background research and people that I've talked to that have worked with him uh, or he's worked for. Um, you know, this guy is a he's he's highly intelligent. Um, he's creative. Um, and he's he's a grinder. He's gonna he's gonna work to find the uh, the answers and, and the solutions. And so uh, I'm excited about you know what I think he can bring to our organization. Now this is gonna bring about some changes on a number of fronts, but the one that they're gonna deal with right away is within the scouting process. Kubiak has been talking to Jeff Ireland since he got hired about some of the different things he covets. And while it doesn't change the type of prospects that they go after, some of the things that they are going to value are going to change a little bit, specifically on the offensive line where they might look for some quicker, faster, more athletic players to fill out that group. We do a lot of inside zone, some outside zone. I mean, again, the, the evaluation of offensive linemen is relatively – Similar, we see we, we we're seeing the player the same way. I don't think the intangible qualities change really at all. Uh, we're looking for smart, tough, dependable guys. Um, you know, they emphasize you know a couple of different skills that um, that they're going to run more often than we will. I mean, like we we ran it call it call it a hundred times. Well, they may run it four hundred times. So that emphasis has to be a little bit more on that on that because they just run it more. Now, Allen made it clear that he got the guy he wanted, and the hope now is that he's able to take over on the offensive side of the ball the same way Allen was able to come in and help Sean Payton out when he was hired as defensive coordinator for the 2016 season. So we'll see how it all plays out, but it sounds like right now they got a vision for how everything's supposed to work, and that starts with the draft process.